What's going on my friends? Josh Baldwin here from Mad Money Millennial. In this video, we are going to talk about the issue of Social Security insolvency and what Congress has planned to shore up money for the trust fund reserves in order to keep benefits running. This applies to those of you on Social Security, SSI, and SSDI benefits. There has been no shortage of partisan bickering over Social Security in recent weeks, as Republicans and Democrats have traded barbs over which party wants to fix the troubled program and which wants to undermine it. You can do me a giant favor by tapping those like and subscribe buttons. This information changes on an almost daily basis, and it's my job to keep you informed with the latest updates. So make sure you watch every single video and watch all the way through so you don't miss out on the most current information. Ladies and gentlemen, I am very proud to announce the release of my first ever book, Beating YouTube, zero to 1,000 subscribers in under 30 days. Available now on Amazon Kindle for only $4.99, or you can purchase a physical paperback copy for $12.99. Click right here on this link to take you straight to the purchase page. I also put the link down in the description. Please check it out. And if you don't like it, feel free to reach out to me and I will personally make every effort to give you your money back. I kid you not, anyone can pick up this book, read it and understand how to make money from YouTube, no matter how old you are or what your financial status is. This is simply another way to make money. It involves work like anything else. However, with YouTube, you don't even need to leave your home so you can easily handle other things you may need to in life, like taking care of children or pets. Buy this book, share with friends and family, and please tell me what you think. I am very open to feedback. Thank you for taking the time to hearing me out about this opportunity. This book combines all the skills and knowledge I've acquired over the many years of making money from YouTube and I'm very excited to now be able to share that information with all of you. Don't miss out on this opportunity of a lifetime and learn how to take back some of your power and put some extra money in your pocket without even needing to leave your home or commute anywhere. Good luck, everyone. The rhetoric got ratcheted up last week when a pair of Republican lawmakers accused Biden administration officials of being dishonest about the Social Security debate. During a Senate Finance Committee hearing, U.S. Republican Senator Bill Cassidy from Louisiana accused Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen of lying about President Joe Biden's willingness to work with lawmakers on Social Security reform. That followed a similar exchange between Senator Mitt Romney from Utah and Shalanda Young director of the White House Office of Management and Budget in discussions centering on Biden's fiscal 2024 budget proposal. In a separate hearing, Romney said Young was simply wrong and not honest to suggest that current members of Congress want to cut Social Security and Medicare. With so much opposition between the political parties, it's hard to see any hope of bipartisan Social Security reform. The only solution, with even a whiff of bipartisan support, is a proposal to raise the full retirement age for Social Security benefits. That proposal, announced last month, is being pushed by Cassidy, the Louisiana Republican, and Senator Angus King, a Maine independent who caucuses with Democrats. The two are leading a group of legislators, that aim to raise the full retirement age to 70 from 67. Raising the full retirement age is seen as one way to lessen the impact of the coming insolvency of Social Security's Old Age and Survivors Insurance Trust Fund, which finances about 20% to 25% of Social Security benefits. The fund is expected to run out of money by the middle of the next decade meaning Social Security will have to rely solely on payroll taxes for funding. Raising the full retirement age might convince more seniors to wait an extra couple of years 
to start claiming Social Security benefits so they can get bigger monthly payments. With fewer people signing up for benefits before turning 70, the Social Security Administration will have fewer benefits to pay out. Raising the full retirement age has bipartisan support among registered voters, though not necessarily raising it all the way to age 70. A 2022 survey of more than 2,500 registered voters conducted by the University of Maryland's Program for Public Consultation found that 75% of respondents favored gradually raising the retirement age from 67 to 68, a move that would eliminate an estimated 14% of the funding shortfall. Support was evenly split between Republicans at 75% and Democrats at 76%. Other solutions with bipartisan support among voters include making more wages subject to the Social Security payroll tax, increasing Social Security withholding, and reducing benefits for high earners. But for now, much of the focus is on whether to raise the full retirement age. Not everyone supports the idea. Social Security advocates and many lawmakers have pushed back against the proposal because of the potential financial impact it would have on seniors who are already struggling to make ends meet. Raising the full retirement age to age 70 significantly cuts benefits for anyone retiring before their new full retirement age, according to the National Committee to Preserve Social Security and Medicare, a nonprofit advocacy group. But spokespersons for Cassidy and King have countered that their plan doesn't include any cuts for Americans currently receiving Social Security benefits, and that many will receive actually additional benefits. All right, my Mad Money Minions, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please leave a like. Comment down below any information that you might have about your own state's SNAP benefits or low-income programs. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell right next to it. Hitting that bell will make sure you get notified exactly when my videos are coming out and not a week or two later. If you're interested in investing, you can now get your one free stock by clicking the link in the description. All right guys, stay safe, stay hustling, stay warm, and I will talk to you all again soon.